11 samples and HDE based for J omega that the desired response is given as 1 or minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 frequency and otherwise it is 0 and it may be represented in graphical form minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2 it is 1 magnitude is 1 and HDE raised for J omega so first step step 1 IDTFT HD n is equal to 1 upon 2 pi minus pi to pi and hd e raised to power g omega e raised to power g omega d omega i will not integrate completely because it will be lengthy so i just put the solution otherwise out of steps will result very lengthy video sin pi n by 2 if you integrate put the values it will be obviously 1 upon 2 pi minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2 that is 1 e raised to power j omega n d omega and further we will integrate and use that Euler's formula Euler's formula you know e raised to power j theta cos theta plus j sin theta and that that Euler's formula sin theta is equal to e raised to power j theta minus e raised to minus j theta upon 2j you will use this formula and you will have that sine term okay sine pi n by pi n and again the limits of n is it is important to sell the limits now second step second step is truncating truncating to n samples here n is equal to 11 given otherwise you can assume n is equal to 5 7 11 or number generally because it will uh, create even symmetry around origin so 11 sample rectangular window you can imagine it is 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 3 4 5 0 around three, okay minus 1 minus 2 minus 5 1 2 3 4 5 obviously minus 3 minus 4 in between this is rectangular window And having n equal to 11 samples. Now again, truncating to hn is equal to hdn dash. We have used the term dash okay for truncation hd dash and Sign it can be written as by two and by two form two by two form. Okay, so that one by two multiply and divide by two one by two sign pi n by two upon pi n by two that two is multiplied divided for now n r truncated to 5 that bar shows minus plus 5 okay so this is the basically 1 by 2 sine theta upon theta form okay so for n equal to 0 that is for origin value h0 is to be find out by 1 by 2 using l hospital rule which said that when sin theta is equal to 0 then it will okay. it will become 1 
and further this filter is symmetrical because theta omega that is angle of h d e raised to power j omega is equal to 0. So for symmetrical filters h n is equal to h that is positive. Okay. Symmetrical filter like that. These values are same. These values are same. These values are same. That is symmetrical around origin. Symmetry around origin. So just going to find out the values for n equal to 1, for n equal to 2, for n equal to 3, for n equal to 4, for n equal to 5. By symmetry we uh, need not to find the value of minus 1 minus 2 because h1 is equal to h1 h minus 1, h2 is equal to h minus 2, h3 is equal to h minus 3 h4 is equal to h minus 4 h5 is equal to h minus 5 and this value comes out by this sine pi n by 2 upon pi n by 2 into 2 putting the value of n is equal to 1 you can calculate it you can calculate for n equal to 2 n equal to 3 n equal to 4 n equal to 5 n and these values comes out to be sine pi by 2 for n equal to 1 for example I am calculating it 0.3183 similarly other values you can calculate minus 0 0.1060 0 0.6366 so next step in next step we have to calculate the z transform step 3 the transfer function that is basically transfer function at z because it is symmetric filter so we will use this formula at 0 center value summation 1 2 n by 2 minus n minus 1 by 2 h n z raised to n plus z raised to minus n because it is symmetrical for both the ends. That is why we are using this formula. Now, after putting this formula and values, expanding n is equal to 11, summation becomes n equal to 1 to 5. Okay. So, putting this formula at 0, at 0 we know 1 by 2, at 0 is 1 by 2 h 0 1 by 2 plus h 1.3183 z raised to power plus 1 z raised to power minus 1 plus next value next value is 0 because this is 0 and equal to 2 third value minus 0.106 that is third value 3 n equal to 3 so z 3 plus z minus 3 fourth value again 0 and fifth value that is 0 0.06366 z is to power 5 plus z is to power minus 5 and this is what the answer transfer function of LPF filter obviously you can rearrange it for uh, making so much clear or on order you can see so uh, realizable filter next is realizable filter to make it realizable filter we have to multiply with z raised to power minus n minus 1 by 2 a n is equal to 11 so we have to multiply by z raised to power minus 5 the 
hz will become z raised to the power minus 5 in the same formula 1 by 2 plus this is the same formula all things and after multiplying you can check this one becomes 0 0.0636 minus 1.06 z raised to minus 2 plus 0.3183 z raised to minus 4 plus 0.5 z raised to power minus 5 plus 0.3183 z raised to minus 6 0.106 z raised to power minus 78 plus 0.06366 z raised to power minus 10 and applying the last step that is applying inverse z transform will results the final hn that is hn is you can uh, put here or i can co put the coefficient at zero because it is symmetric you know i know it is symmetric so at zero and this coefficient are same 0 0.06366 similarly h1 h1 and h9 coefficient are same zero here and h2 and h8 coefficient are h2 and h8 coefficient are minus 0.106 and h3 and h7 coefficient are h3 again 0 h4 and h6 coefficient are h4 and h6 coefficient are 0.3183 and h5 and coefficient is center coefficient that is 0.5 so this is the realizable filter one thing uh, i would like to again remind you while passing through this rectangular window hd dash n pass through rectangular window pass through rectangular window makes it hd dash and similar because but truncated but truncated to truncated to 11 samples because i have explained that passing through window is means it, it just means that pass multiplying each coefficient that is one is multiplied with fifth coefficient and minus fifth and all the coefficients are multiplied with one so it just affect that the same values but truncated to 11 samples only okay the significance is that passing from rectangular window doesn't change anything but it truncated to now that number of samples for which window is made up of okay thank you i hope you know well